Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to the channel. Um, thank you guys for tuning in so much. It really means a lot to me that you guys watch my videos and y'all react to my videos and um, and that y'all pretty much like my videos, guys. You know, it's been fun. Um, today is day four of my YouTube channel, and I'm really um, happy that you guys are tuning in, watching, and um, commenting, and it really warms my heart that I'm able to react to you guys and, you know, find new people to react with and Y'all are just so kind, and I want to thank you guys for that. That really means a lot to me. Um, and let's get into today's video, shall we, guys? All right, let's get into it. Today, guys, I'm pretty much talking about my favorite video game. And if you're not into that, if you're not into um, games or whatever, then this video may not be for you. Um, this is a different video. Um, I'm pretty much going to be talking about my favorite game and pretty much talking to you guys about who's my who's my favorite team and who I like to use, who I would like to use, and who, who I would love to learn and for you new guys that are playing the game, I would love to show you guys and help you guys um, pick pick good teams, how to learn combos, stuff like that, and just kind of give you advice on how to do that. Um, well, anyway, let's get into it. Part one, um, the game I'm talking about is Dragon Ball Fighters, guys. Um, Dragon Ball Fighters is my favorite fighting game probably in the past 10 years. Um, the last good fighting game I probably played was probably, I don't know, like Mortal Kombat back in the day. But ever since Dragon Ball Fighters came out, this is the only fighting game I've been playing in the last five years. Um, it really, I really have fun with it. I rage, I, I get mad, I get happy, I get sad. You know, it kind of, it runs me through all my personalities and all my moods in one hour. Because of how good the game is, how bad the game can be, or, you know, everything that's in it. Um, it's my favorite game. And if you'd like to say, if you're in the Dragon Ball, and you love playing Dragon Ball Fighters like I do, then this video is for you. Um... And I suggest, you know, just pay, especially for new guys, just paying attention and kind of trying to get the hang of it because people will leave you behind and they won't, you know, people will train you and then they'll say, oh, the only way you can learn is if you get, you know, beat up in this game or if you, if you get your butt kicked, then that's not true. It really just makes you more mad and you get uncomfortable and you start getting upset and it doesn't really work out that way. So I'm just here to help you guys try to figure it out on your own, how to pick a team um, how to learn combos and stuff like that. Um, for starters, my favorite team, and I'm gonna put them up on the screen, um, UI Goku, Team Gohan, and Tien. That is my favorite team and my best team that I know in this game. Um, I just know a bunch of combos with them. Um, my rank is Ultra Instinct Sign. That should tell you I'm pretty up there in the rank. At least I think I am. Um, and if you're starting out, I suggest picking up UI Goku, and I suggest picking up Tien because they're really one of, they're more of the easy characters to learn, just like Goku Black or just like um, Teen Gohan. It's pretty, it's kind of easy. Um, but you know, you new guys, I suggest you pick up someone that's easy, and then as you get comfortable, then I suggest you to pick new characters because um, the the better comfortable you are, the more comfortable you will be with using more difficult characters. So, like, if you would start today and you went to pick up Fuse Amazu, you're going to have a hard time because his combos are very difficult. And they're just very, he has different, you know, things in his kit and everything. Um, so, I do not suggest to pick up Fuse Amazu right now. Like I said, if you're new, I suggest you like Goku, any of the fusions, um, any of the base characters. Um, like I said, Team Gohan, Super Saiyan Vegeta, Super Saiyan Goku, Krillin, Yamcha, you know. Um, you know, but the, on the enemy team, like, Cell, Ginyu, Kid Buu, um, Nappa, um, they're, they're not easy, I don't think. I don't think they're easy. I think they're, I think they take time to learn. You usually have to go and lab with them. Um, but that's for any character, guys. But, um, before you, if you're just now starting, I suggest you pick a team. Pick a team, go lab with them. And learn what their combos are. Learn what their frame data is. Learn what combos they have and when, when you should block and when you shouldn't. When you should vanish and when you shouldn't. You know, just kind of learn your character by heart. I know UI Goku, Chico on and TM by heart. I know their frame data. I know when to block. I know when not to block. I know when to reflect. Um, and characters like Videl, sh instead, she doesn't have a reflect, she has a dodge. And then Master Roshi has doesn't have a super dash. He has kind of like a jump type thing. 
So um, I would really try to avoid Videl or um, Master Roshi for right now if you're just learning. And as you get comfortable, then I would suggest you go for the harder characters. Um, some characters have lower damage than others, and some have higher damage than others. Um, the fusions are pretty broken. Um, they actually just gave the fusions a meter nerf because, you know, of how overly broken it was to run triple fusions. Um, but that's my advice for newcomers for picking characters and... Um, those are the teams that I suggest you to learn. Um, and I want you to comment in the comment, guys. What is y'all's best team and what y'all are running? Um, and I want y'all to let me know what, what y'all think of my team on a scale of 1 to 10. Um, and I just want to know you got your guys' opinions because it really does matter to me what your opinions are. You know, I really do care for y'all's opinions because maybe I'll change my team if y'all you know, rather me do a different team, or if y'all want me to learn a new team, I will literally learn a new team. And, um, but those are my suggestions if you're new. Um, try to avoid rank as much as you can until you know what you're doing, because if you go in rank, not what you're doing, you're going to get slaughtered. You know, especially, I mean, not at first, but once you start ranking up and you don't really know what you're doing, a good, decent player is going to what, mop you because they, because there's gonna be a bunch of Smurfs, and Smurf is pretty much like, um, say on one account they're like Rose or something, and they're pretending to be a low rank just to, just because they can beat on new players, pretty much. So you'll run into that a lot. Um, but like I say, guys, um, I'm gonna drop my gamer tag below. Um, and if you guys want to add me on Xbox, and if y'all want to battle or y'all want to fight, I'm down just whenever you guys, you know, if y'all are interested in fat battling, um, I'm down to give you guys a challenge. Um, and I'm going to drop my favorite combo at the end of this video. I'm going to drop a small clip at the end of uh, my TN TOD, because it's my favorite TOD in the whole game, guys. It's my favorite TOD in the whole game. Um, but other than that, guys, that's pretty much it for that. Um, I just want to come on and tell you guys what, you know, my favorite game and what I suggest you newcomers to do and, um, and everything, guys. And for combo-wise, um, pretty much just lab, guys. Combos, you can never not lab enough. You know, I lab for at least an hour every day before I go into ranked or before I play my friends. You know, it's to get that, that muscle memory in, you know, having the combos new on your mind. So I suggest you lab every single day until you get the hang of it, and then even after that, keep labbing. But other than that, guys, that's all the advice I can really give. Um, if I missed anything, guys, please let me know if I missed anything. Um, but other than that, I appreciate you guys for tuning in this video. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope it gave you guys help for it and if, uh, good advice. But um, other than that, guys, thank you so much for tuning in, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Thanks. Hey guys, this is me doing a TN TOD on Android 16, and it's very simple and easy, guys, and I just hope you enjoy, and thank you guys for watching.